What's up guys, it's your boys Wolke back with another preview for pre-order and today we're going to take a look at four different cute little flocked Pokemon that you need for your collection. These are super cute. My kids fell in love. I might have to buy one for each one times three, but we're going to be taking a look at these uh, P uh, Pikachu, Charlamander, Bulbasaur, and Squirtle. So with that being said, before we go any farther, make sure you guys are subscribed by hitting that white bar icon down the bottom right. Hit the bell icon next to it so when I do post videos like this one, you'll get that little ring notification that I've posted that video. Then you guys can watch, comment, like, and share. And again, thank you guys so very much for the continued love and support that all of you guys show on this channel every single day. I can't thank you guys enough and keep doing what you guys are doing and we'll continue to grow together. With that being said, let's get into these cute little flocked characters they're not funko i thought they were funko but they're not it doesn't even the the company it's from it's kind of a, I, I can't pronounce it but we're gonna be taking a look at them for you guys um they're not too bad in price they're gonna be coming out this year uh this next month um for 36.99 and they're super cute so let's take a look you guys can see right here obviously Pikachu is going to be the first one. I am using the Big Bad Toy Store website again, like I uh, almost normally do 90% of the time. It's a great website to use, great company. I'm not being sponsored by any way, um, but if they're watching this, hey, uh, hook me up with a sponsor. But with that being said, my honest review is that I've been buying from them for quite a long time. I've never had any problems with any damaged product or anything like that. It's just a great company, and shipping is not even that bad either, so... But again, continuing with Pikachu, super cute. You guys can see from both sides, it looks like it's fuzzy and furry and kind of thing. Um, these guys are not that big. They're about five inches tall, but super cute. So you can still see them on your guys' uh, shelves. Um, it's made of a flocked and PVC based on, obviously, the Pokemon franchise. Um, it's non-articulated, so you can't move anything. You can't move the ears, can't move the tail and stuff like that, which you don't really want with something like this. It's just something to cute put cute on your shelf now they're $36.99 a little high but you pay for um, Pokemon's brand because Pokemon has been around since I was I think five six seven years old and it's going to continue because people love Pokemon so again not too bad of a price I mean I, they could have put the $50 price tag on there and you I guarantee there have been people that would have bought in this as well um, the next one to that one is going to be Charlamander, you guys can see in his cute little fiery tail version. Again, $36. This one is a little smaller than Pikachu, mostly because Pikachu has some tall ears. But again, made of the flock PVC and based on the the mo or the movie and TV shows, I should say, or the card game. Um, and then cute little Charlamander uh, is not articulated as well. So none of them can move. So it's just pretty much staying put. Um, they do come in these little cute little packages. Uh, pocket monsters flock doll is what they're called um, but still cute um, next to that one is the squirtle one of my favorites I do like uh, squirtle Bulbasaur they are my uh, my favorite type of Pokemon um, I do like Pikachu but I like my my squirtle um, again the squirtle is super cute I myself am not going to be getting these because it just doesn't fit my collection I do have Funko Pops just because I knew that they were going to be some type of rare in the future but they did look cute. These do look cute, but I just don't, they're not into me or I, I'm not into them. My kids are, so I might be buying these for my kids. Uh, but I want to get back to the people that love Pokemon. I want you guys to know about it. So that's why I'm making this video. Let's continue. Um, again, this one is a little bit smaller. Squirtle is probably one of the smallest ones, but again, his little cute form, non-articulated, so his arms, legs, and tail does not move. Um, and that last but not least, we have Bulbasaur. Um, Bulbasaur is again not articulated. Uh, a little, oh, apparently smaller than the rest of them. I thought he was gonna be a little bit bigger. Uh, but you guys can see the different sizes inside package, out of side package. There are gonna be probably those that keep it in the package. Some of them will keep it out, but. I mean, that's just the way you want to present your Funko or your, your, your displays. Like some of them, like these ones I had to take out because I, they just didn't do justice inside their packages. But then when it's like these ones, I want to keep them in there. It's just overall your preference if you want to keep them inside box. So all four of them together, um, if we tally this up on a calculator, we're looking at $36.99 times four is about $150, give or take, in your area, depending on if you're in um, Canada, Japan, whatever have you, and your taxes or whatever you are, you're going to be spending about $150 for all four. So, 
hopefully my kids don't see all one only, only one kid has seen this so far so we'll just keep it hush hush because they're expensive but with that being said, hopefully you guys enjoyed. Make sure, guys, you let me know if you're going to be getting any of these. If you're going to be getting one, two, three, all of them, none of them. Let me know if this video helped you out. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you love Pokemon. Just overall helps out the channel. Um, and don't forget to subscribe. And we'll see you guys in the next one. So keep it real, keep it safe. And as always, keep nerding on. And we'll see you guys next time.